protagonist of one of the most disappointing performances of recent times in the UFC octagon. William Knight has become the target of heavy criticism from the fight community, especially on social media. But it seems, some of these virtual attacks cross the limits of what is acceptable. In a live broadcast made on his official Instagram profile, Knight admitted that he had a performance below expectations last Saturday, 18, on the card of UFC Vegas 69, when he was defeated by March and Pracnio, by unanimous decision of the judges, but questioned the attacks he has been suffering on the internet. According to the light heavyweight, 93 kilograms, some fans went so far as to send death threats via private messages on their social networks. At the end of the day, I went there, froze, didn't do my part and lost the fight. I lost the fight. You didn't lose that fight, I did. Some of you wanted me to win. Some of you bet on me. I understand. In life, human beings aren't perfect, but I'm taking responsibility for my actions because I didn't do shit. Exactly what happened. I stood there, froze, and I take full responsibility. Knight said before continuing, I know what I have to do in my next fight. All these crazy messages I'm getting, all these disrespectful messages, I understand. You have the right to be angry. I read the messages, you threatening my life, talking crazy, saying I don't belong in the UFC, all that stuff. But when I was undefeated for three years, you were all riding the wave. Nightmare, as he is known, was unrecognizable during the match. During the 15 minutes of dispute, the American connected to just eight blows exploded in Pracnio, against 79 of his opponent. The American stance even allowed the pole to break the record for the highest number of leg kicks applied in a three-round fight in ultimate history, with 63 strikes applied in the region.